Hello. Hey. Hey you guys, welcome back to my vlog. Um, I know it's been a minute, but we're gonna catch up later. Okay, we're gonna catch up later, I promise. But um, today I did some damage shopping wise and I just wanna show y'all what I got. So let me go grab it really quick. I'll be right back. So bad. So I went to Ulta, obviously. And um, I went there for a few items, but I also went there to do some damage, some retail therapy. And um, come to find out one of my friends or like my old coworkers, she's a manager there there now. So she was like showing me around and she was like, oh, we just got this in and it was sold out and it was back, it's back in stock. So you should get it and try it. So, okay, so. Just calling me. Hey. Okay, I'm just getting on board. But yeah. Look. Ooh, that looks good. Um, uh, I didn't get this from Ulta. I got this from Target. It is the African, authentic African um, scalp care conditioner. Um, I heard good things about it on TikTok a while ago and they finally have it at Target, but like it's in sm smaller bottles. They used to have like a really, really big bottle. I don't need a big bottle like that. We're gonna try it out and see how I like it. Mm. And then I got the Buy That Boost HG conditioner. This is my personal fave. It's it tingles my scalp and I like it. That's all I can really say. It tingles my scalp and I like it. <laughs> um, let's see what else. Let's do this. I got the Touch Hand, the Touch Land hand sanitizer and watermelon from my purse. The girls, you know, have this in their bag, so I won't want to. That's my only reasoning. Um, I got these eye patches. They were just like by the cash register and I just grabbed them. So hopefully they work good. Then, holy grail, holy grail. This thermal spray, um, I've been loving it and I, it's just good for the dry skin girls, okay? If you have dry skin, check it out. If you don't, still good to have on deck to just to refresh your skin in general. And then I got a poo poo -puri. Um, You know, I don't really have to explain that. <laughs> um, and then I got the Dermalogica Daily Micro Exfoliant. I really like this. I wanted to get the big one, but $60, no. And this will last me like a month and a half. So I think the little mini size will do. I got the Beauty Bakery um, setting powder in almond. I have the shade that's one shade lighter than this right now, but it's too light for me in the summer. So I just went down the shade. Hopefully I like it. Then I got this lip oil. I don't know if you guys can see it. Come on. There we go. This lip oil. Um, it is the Claire's lip oil in honey. I feel like the packaging has changed since the time I originally like first first got this. Pre before TikTok. Oh, this just clear. Okay, cool. Uh, I like this stuff a lot, a lot, a lot. Ten out of ten recommend. Um, the cherry is a really nice flavor. I mean, flavor color for like your clean girl aesthetic days. Really like that one. And then, like I said, my friend works at Ulta. And she told me to get this because all the girls love it. I just put on a lip oil so I can't really try it on. Oh, it's the, we go. Maybe it's too bright in the background. LA Girl Lip Plumper. It's supposed to be a dupe for the um, 
two-faced better than sex or I know it's something else I'll put it up on the screen what we do for that we'll see how that works out and then I have the little travel size of the snail mucin I was looking for the big size and they didn't have it probably just order it online but for now that will suffice um, then I got the DHC cleansing oil I heard it's just really good I want to try it out that's why I got the mini one I just saw this and I just want to try it out it's the NYX this is milky gloss and cookies and milk hopefully I like it now this I'm really excited about this it's the tanning um, a long tan platinum so I can tan myself before I go to a destination. So Y'all will see soon. I'm preparing for a vacation and I can't wait. And then I got like the tanning mitt. Um, I will definitely record. I will definitely record when I do that. But I'm gonna make dinner. Graduating, I um, caught 
COVID. Me and my partner are stuck in a rut for a week. Wasn't that bad. I just got into a really bad funk. I was looking for a big girl job. It was really hard to find one, but shout out to my friend Portia for helping me find my current job. I work for Indeed at home. I'm a tech girly, period. Um, love my job. Indeed, I live there. I've been there for since October, I think. I don't remember. One or the other. Just pray it's no shows in it. When I have nails, I don't crack eggs the best. Indeed, I love it. I look forward to like moving up within the company if that is in my cards. If it's not, that's also fine. But I love where I'm at right now. I moved as well. Um, I moved to a, I'm not good at multitasking. I moved to a two bedroom apartment and I live it here and a little tour um, when I'm ready. That doesn't seem right, but okay, it's a lot of oil. Um, that's a lot of oil. Clearly, I can't help you guys. I just stopped talking. <laughs> Not my strong suit. Okay. I think that is great. So, yeah, lashes happened, and I'm in a better space now. That's why I'm coming back. I want to talk about post grad life and how. You know, once you graduate, you have all these expectations, except from like your family, but like, it just doesn't like the way the job market is set up right now. It just doesn't happen as fast as anyone would like, of course. And it sucks because you're in school for how long? You're busting your ass like on the verge of, you know, dropping out and stuff like <laughs> No matter how much you want that degree, it's not easy. It's not supposed to be easy, but quarantine made it 10 times harder. Oh my god, it's so big. I really like I don't know what I'm saying. She had like a, I don't have a little like ice cream scoop thing. Should have got that while I was at the store. It's just not easy and you know, everybody moves at their own pace and if it wasn't for Portia, I'm pretty sure I would still be looking for a job right now. Because I really didn't know what I wanted to do. And I didn't necessarily want to move back to Houston where the market for like a health science degree is probably the best. It's better in Houston than it is in Austin at least. You know, because Houston is like the medical capital of the world. Don't quote me on that. I don't know for sure. <laughs> it's something like that. Like now that I work from home, I've really been struggling with um, morning routine and just overall routine in general and, you know, getting, being active. Like I don't have to leave the house. <laughs> That's the con with working from home. You, you literally have no need to leave the house at all. I just go to, I leave the house for a grocery store and that's it. I abuse DoorDash. I really need just to delete it off my phone. I'm gonna pick up the camera because I really do have a lot of exciting things going on that I feel like it'll be cool to vlog, but also I just want to get that stuff on camera. Like, why not? So I can have it to look back on. talking loud enough my boyfriend's going to sleep he has like a crazy work schedule and I don't like ideally I should be asleep hence why I have a bad morning routine but 
this is not gonna turn out right. I'll show y'all how it looks in a second. And I complain about my weight all the time. All right, so you're done. You look nice. I like the girl on TikTok though. <laughs> Not like that at all. But they need to go over. I don't think I'm gonna taste these, but I will give you all a quick view of it. Cool down in like five minutes, and then I will sign off because it is late. It is Sunday. I have work tomorrow. Um, it's 10:19, so I would love to be in bed by 11. I really want to get into a routine, and I say this every Sunday, but we will see. There's always tomorrow, right? <laughs> tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. But no, we're gonna get it together because I have no excuse at this point. I'm in a better headspace for the most part. You know, nothing's perfect, but I'm in a better headspace. So I hope to meet my goals and I can't wait to take you guys on this journey with me see you guys soon if you like this video like like subscribe and comment um it helps out a lot 